550 right now. Today we wrap up our series on high paying jobs here in the Low Country that don't require a four year degree. That's right. All week long, News 2's Colby Thielen has been bringing us stories about these blue collar jobs and hopes that people can find them and fill them. Today's career respiratory therapy. There was rarely a dull moment in the respiratory care classroom at Trident Technical College as students rushed to save the medical simulation mannequins. It's fast paced, it's exciting. We have a buzz. Instructor Laurel Glover gives updates on the patient's status unresponsive, no pulse. Students prepare to intubate. Critical function in their future careers. Our students complete both respiratory courses here at the college and they complete clinical rotations through a lot of the area hospitals as well as through some of those alternative care settings. Settings like private practices, sleep labs, or even research. But often mistaken for nursing, it's a field that some may not be aware of. Patients even might not realize that respiratory therapy is a career option or an individual that they might encounter in the hospital setting. For these future RTs, it's all about the airways, practicing for ventilator care, pulmonary function, neonatal intensive care, and medication distribution. We actually have a lot of flexibility. And a lot of opportunity. Our placement 2015 and 2014 was 100 percent. So there definitely are a lot of students that graduate knowing where they're going to go and work. The minimum requirement is two years, but many will go on to achieve much more. And as long as we need breath in our lungs, there will be a need for RTs in our hospitals. How about that? Mm -hmm. On average, we're told respiratory therapists make about 60 grand a year. Starting out, most will make around 40, but of course, that can change based on location and additional degrees. For a look back at all of this week's stories, you can head over to our website, camelandju.com.